Just dismissed, a Catholic bishop accused of driving drunk right here in Rhode Island is now in the clear after reaching an agreement with police. Eyewitness News reporter Andrew Adamson joins us from South Kingstown with new details. The legal battle for a local bishop arrested on suspicion of drunk driving wrapped up today. I talked to the bishop's lawyer following today's proceedings at Wakefield District Court. It took just a matter of minutes for Worcester Bishop Robert McManus's misdemeanor criminal charges to be dropped in district court on Tuesday. While the bishop was noticeably absent from the proceedings, his lawyer was there for the dismissal. The, the bishop, again, is, is sorry. Uh, he's remorseful for what, what occurred. On May 4th, police arrested McManus on suspicion of drunk driving after a hit and run near his Narragansett vacation home. The 61-year-old bishop was originally charged with a DUI and fleeing the scene of an accident. I mean, he's a, a fine man and this was just uh, aberrant behavior on his part and I, I, I think the whole community was saddened when they heard that it happened. Later in May, McManus appeared in traffic court where he admitted to refusing to submit a chemical test. That admission led to an agreement with Narragansett police to drop the criminal charges against him. The normal practice in a, in a case like this is if a person who was a first offender, which the, the bishop regrettably is a first offender, so in exchange for his plea at the traffic court, the town agreed to dismiss the charges here. The bishop's license is suspended for six months. He also has to take DUI education courses, perform community service, and pay a $945 fine. He stepped to the plate, accepted responsibility. Now that the charges against Bishop McManus have been dropped here at Wakefield District Court, his lawyer tells us that he's hoping to put this behind him and move on with his life. With the South County Mobile Newsroom, Andrew Adamson, Eyewitness News.